In our other top story, after a six-month investigation, Bishop Museum's CEO and two other top leaders stepped down immediately today. Mahea Lani Richardson has been following the months-long turmoil and joins us with the latest. Mahea. Well, Mark, it's unclear if the three leaders were fired or resigned on their own. Now, what we do know is that the full board of Bishop Museum met yesterday and approved their departures in a unanimous vote, and that was announced today. But they're not releasing any details. In July, CEO Melanie Ide, Vice President of Operations, Planning and Program Management, Ka Ivi Yoon, and General Counsel Baron Oda were placed on leave in July during an independent investigation. Now, sources told Hawaii News Now and a attorney looked at allegations of a hostile work environment. A board statement says the investigator interviewed 43 current and former members of the museum staff. More than half were requested by the three leaders, and that significantly extended the length of the investigation. We reached out to Ide and did not hear back. Her supporters were demanding an investigation by the state attorney general, claiming the museum had breached its fiduciary duties. But the board said leadership put in place during the investigation was very very capable. Now we're told that an interim CEO will be put in place and there will be an international search for new leadership. I'm Mahalani Richardson, Hawaii News Now. Thank you very much, Mahal.